Keanu Reeves is a Hollywood enigma, an actor who has managed to maintain a spotless reputation in an industry often mired in scandal and ego-driven conflicts. His undeniable on-screen charisma, combined with a humble and down-to-earth personality, has earned him a legion of fans worldwide. However, despite this, powerful forces within Hollywood seem determined to see him fail. The question then arises, what is it about Keanu that scares Hollywood's elite so much? What makes this man, who appears to be loved by fans and colleagues alike, a target for industry insiders? In this in-depth exploration, we'll unravel the strange battles Keanu Reeves has faced in Tinseltown and why Hollywood might be eager to push him out. The Strange Battles of Keanu Reeves in Tinseltown Keanu's journey in Hollywood has been nothing short of extraordinary. For over three decades, he has built a career that many actors can only dream of. With iconic roles in films like The Matrix, Speed, and John Wick, he has become a global superstar. But unlike many others in his position, Keanu has remained remarkably true to himself, choosing authenticity over the polished image that Hollywood often demands. Despite his continued success, Keanu has faced opposition from some powerful figures within the industry. There's an irony to this, his authenticity, the very quality that endears him to millions of fans, seems to be part of the problem in an industry that often favors superficiality and manufactured personas. Keanu's ability to stay grounded in an environment that frequently prizes ego over integrity has set him apart, but it has also made him a target. What is it about Keanu that bothers Hollywood so much? Could it be that his modesty and kindness shine a spotlight on the industry's flaws? Perhaps his realness serves as a mirror that reflects an unflattering image of a business more focused on profits than people. While many would assume that his honesty and dedication would make him a perfect fit for Hollywood, it's possible that these very qualities are what threaten the status quo. The Early Life of Keanu Reeves To understand Keanu Reeves' resilience, we must first explore his early life. Born in Beirut in 1964, Keanu faced adversity from a young age. His father abandoned the family when Keanu was just three years old, leaving his mother to raise him and his sister alone. This led to a nomadic childhood, with the family moving from city to city, first Sydney, then New York, and finally Toronto. By the time he was a teenager, Keanu had attended four different high schools in just five years. Struggling with dyslexia, his academic life was anything but easy, and he wasn't particularly well-liked by his teachers. However, amidst these challenges, Keanu discovered his love for acting. By the age of nine, he was performing on stage in local theaters, and by fifteen, he knew he wanted to pursue acting as a career. At seventeen, he made the bold decision to drop out of high school and focus entirely on his passion. A few years later, he moved to Los Angeles, where he began to slowly build his career with small roles in television and film. It wasn't an overnight success. One of Keanu's early jobs was on the Canadian sitcom Hanging In, far from the glamorous roles he would later be known for. But his persistence and dedication to his craft eventually paid off, culminating in his breakout role in the film River's Edge in 1986. This gritty drama earned him critical attention, and it wasn't long before Keanu became a household name with films like Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure and Point Break. The Price of Success As Keanu's star rose, so too did the pressures of fame. While he was becoming one of Hollywood's most bankable action stars, his personal life was marked by tragedy. In the early 1990s, his younger sister, Kim, was diagnosed with leukemia. Keanu took on the role of her caregiver, showing the same dedication and loyalty in his personal life that he displayed in his work. He quietly donated millions of dollars to cancer research without seeking publicity or praise, proving that his generosity went far beyond his on-screen persona. Then, in 1993, Keanu faced the heartbreaking loss of one of his closest friends, River Phoenix, who died of a drug overdose at just 23 years old. The loss deeply affected Keanu, who had formed a close bond with River while working on the film My Own Private Idaho. In interviews, Keanu has spoken about the emotional toll this tragedy took on him, but once again, 
he chose to channel his grief into his work, rather than retreating from the spotlight. Just six years later, as Keanu was reaching new heights of fame with The Matrix, his personal life took another devastating turn. He and his then-girlfriend, Jennifer Syme, lost their daughter, Ava, who was stillborn in 1999. The tragedy took a toll on their relationship, and not long after, Jennifer herself tragically died in a car accident. These losses could have broken anyone, but Keanu displayed an incredible resilience, choosing to continue his work while maintaining a sense of privacy and dignity that is rare in Hollywood. Hollywood's Backlash Keanu's reputation as a humble and generous person stands in stark contrast to the cutthroat nature of Hollywood. He is known for his kindness both on and off the screen, often taking pay cuts to ensure that other cast and crew members are compensated fairly. Despite this, or perhaps because of it, Keanu has faced significant backlash from certain corners of the industry. One notable incident came in 2019, when actor Matthew Perry made a shocking and harsh remark about Keanu in his memoir. Perry questioned why talented actors like River Phoenix and Heath Ledger had passed away while Keanu was still alive. Fans were outraged by the comment, and Perry was forced to apologize. But the remark highlighted a deeper issue, why would someone target Keanu? A man who has seemingly done nothing but good. This wasn't an isolated incident. Keanu has been dealing with hidden resentment in Hollywood for years. One of the most telling examples came after he refused to participate in the sequel to Speed. Keanu recognized that Speed 2 was a doomed project and chose to walk away from it. Rather than respecting his decision, Fox Studios blacklisted him for over a decade, barring him from participating in their projects. It was a punishment for his refusal to compromise his principles, a recurring theme in Keanu's career. Keanu's Stance Against AI and Technology Another source of tension between Keanu and Hollywood has been his vocal opposition to certain technological advancements in the film industry. While Hollywood has eagerly embraced CGI and AI-generated performances, Keanu has been a vocal critic. His skepticism about the overuse of technology in film stems from a personal experience early in his career. In one of his movies, a tear was digitally added to his face in a scene where he hadn't cried. This experience left a lasting impression on Keanu, and he has since been adamant about not allowing digital alterations to his performances. Keanu's stance against AI-generated performances is part of a larger concern he has about the future of art and creativity. While many in Hollywood view AI as the next big thing, Keanu is worried about its implications for the authenticity of acting and the role of human expression in storytelling. He has refused to allow AI recreations of himself in his contracts, a decision that has further alienated him from certain powerful figures in the industry. Hollywood's Lone Wolf in a Changing Industry Keanu's refusal to conform to Hollywood's expectations has earned him a reputation as a bit of a maverick. He has been called difficult, stubborn, and even rebellious, but these labels only serve to highlight his commitment to his principles. In an industry where so many are willing to compromise for the sake of fame or fortune, Keanu stands out as someone who refuses to be controlled. This independence has made him something of an outsider in Hollywood. While many actors rely on the support of the industry's power players to maintain their status, Keanu has built a career that thrives on his connection with his fans rather than the approval of studio executives. He is one of the few actors who can genuinely say that he doesn't need Hollywood to succeed, Hollywood needs him. The Legacy of Keanu Reeves what makes Keanu Reeves truly remarkable is that, despite all the challenges he has faced, both personally and professionally, he remains a beloved figure. His fans appreciate him not just for his acting talent, but for his humility, generosity, and resilience. He is a rare example of a celebrity who has managed to maintain his privacy in a world that thrives on attention and spectacle. Keanu's legacy extends far beyond his film roles. He has become a symbol of kindness and authenticity in an industry that often prioritizes image over substance. His ability to remain grounded, despite his fame, has only endeared him further to his fans, who see him as a role model for how to navigate life's challenges with grace and dignity. 
Through it all, Keanu Reeves continues to do what he loves, acting. He may never be fully embraced by Hollywood's elite, but that's not what motivates him. He remains true to himself, and in doing so, he has built a career and a legacy that will endure long after the industry's power players have come and gone. In the end, Keanu Reeves isn't just an actor, he's a testament to the power of authenticity in a world that often values appearances. Hollywood may try to push him out, but as long as he has the support of his fans, Keanu will continue to stand tall, a beacon of hope for those who believe in staying true to themselves.